we do. Good. Just kind of your message as a leader after uh, a loss like that. Yeah. I mean, you know, it's a long season. Uh, can't, you know, get caught up in it. Uh, you know, it sucks, uh, obviously. Uh, it is what it is. Uh, you know, 24-hour rule. You know, watch the tape get better. Uh, focus on nickels. We got 11 more weeks to play, you know, and then hopefully, you know, obviously after that. But, you know, that's the focus right now is just stick together. You know, we got a really good team, a uh, really deep team. We just got to play clean. Um, you know, we had opportunities uh, to, you know, like, you know, like you say, step on their throat. Um, you know, we had an opportunity to put the game away. Uh, we didn't do it. And so, uh, you know, I think that's the focus is just getting better, staying together. Darren, what did you, what did you like and what do you, you know? How tough is this loss to swallow? Yeah, I mean, it sucks. Uh, you know, obviously, we wanted to come out here and get the win. Um, but, you know, I, I think that it will also be a very good, you know, learning experience for us as a team um, and where we want to end up this year. So. What, did, what did you like and where did you feel you left some stuff out there? Yeah, I mean, like I said, you know, I think we need to play cleaner um, in our operations and things like that. Um, you know, focus on doing our job as players um, and executing the correct way. After those false starts from Will, was the last one you talked to him, was it, what was he missing? No, I mean, that's not Will's fault, you know, like I said, you know, we're, we're, fa we're facing this as a team, um, you know, and I got to do a better job communicating with those guys, um, so I'll take that all day, um, but, you know, at the end of the day, you know, we're blessed, you know, God is good, you know, I'm thankful uh, that I had this opportunity, like I always say, and, um, you know, we, we give him the glory and the goods and the bads. So. Did you find anything in the second half there, kind of leaning on him with the run game? Yeah, I mean, you know, off the line did a really good job uh, the second half. You know, we knew we had to establish the line of scrimmage. Um, you know, I thought they did a good job. You know, obviously, uh, there's learning experiences there. Uh, you know, I think we'll really continue to get better. What was going on there in the second half, like when y'all had a chance to put the game away after the fourth down stop in particular? Why do you yeah. think maybe that clean execution didn't happen? I mean, you know, I, I can't quite answer that right now without, uh, you know, seeing the tape. Um, you know, like I said, we're going to, you know, get back to the building, uh, you know, watch the tape, make corrections, uh, move on. You know, like I said, we got 11 more weeks to play the regular season. So that's what we're focused on. The idea of that hurry up on third down, was that just to try to get him off guard and yeah. get a I mean, playoff? something everybody does, you know, yeah. trying to go fast. Um, you know, most time works. It didn't work. It is what it is. You know, like I said, we just got to, you know, get back to the drawing board, you know, watch it on tape, make corrections. We'll add to the red zone struggles. <laughs> Uh, you know, I mean, I don't know anything particular. Like I said, you know, we haven't watched tape yet. Um, and so, you know, obviously through watching the tape, we'll be able to make corrections and, and get better, stay together. Um, like I said, I think we have a very talented team. Um, and if I think I think the sky is the limit for us. Um, and, you know, just, you know, getting everybody back healthy, getting everybody back focused and, uh, you know, working together. We saw some flashes there. Mason had a nice night. Kyron early, you know, on. I guess, do you feel like you, you got things, obviously, to work with? Yeah. yeah, like I said, you know, we have a good team. We do. I, I really believe that. And, um, you know, adversity, you know, it makes you better. So, you know, as long as we can stick together uh, and, and move in the right direction, I think that this is a learning experience that will only help us the rest of the season. How you good is he do something in the second half to kind of limit what Kyron's production? No, I mean, you know, obviously things were different, but like I said, you know, I, I'm going to have to see the tape. So. How good was it to see John kind of get going yeah. downhill? No, John Emery did a great job. You know, he gave us a spark, you know, coming off the bench and had some really, really good runs. Um, you know, so I'm really proud of him. I thought he did a really good job. Aaron Anderson, too. He yeah, and Aaron really stepped up. You know, he made some plays tonight that were big, uh, big moments. Uh, you know, I should have hit him on that second down. You know, uh, I got to make that play. You know, that's something that I'm gonna, you know, that's gonna bother me for, you know, for another six days until I get a chance to go play again. Um, so, you know, I'll be thinking about that play for a long time. Um, couple more but, from those you know, I thought he did a really good job stepping up. Coach just, Kelly said that the sum of this team is better than any one of its parts. What does that mean to you as y'all work through this loss? Yeah, you know, like I said, you know, just staying together, staying focused. You know, how can this, you know, use this as an experience to to make us better, not tear us down, you know. Uh, at the end of the day, you know, we're we're 11 weeks away. Like I said, you know, we still have 11, you know, 11 games left. And um, there's a lot of season left to be played, you know. Two years ago, we lost week one, we were in the SEC championship. You know, we are in contention for the playoffs. And that's where, you know, we see ourselves. And, you know, one loss does not change that. We've talked a lot about the leadership of this team. It's going to be tested right now, right? So how, how do you guys as leaders get together and kind of set the tone going forward? Yeah, uh, you know, I think it's coming together, really. It's just everybody staying together, staying positive, you know, focused on getting better. Um, and I think, you know, uh, from the makeup of what I believe that our team is, I think that's what we'll do. What was Coach Kelly's demeanor like post game with y'all? Yeah, I mean, you know, he, he's very uh, obviously was disappointed um, in some of the penalties that we we had. Um, you know, like I said, we got to play cleaner uh, as a whole team. Um, you know, it's everybody, you know, offense and defense. And um, you know, I think we got to come together, stay, uh, play cleaner, you know, fix operational things. And you know, I think we got a really good shot. How satisfied were you? Thank you. Is it Mike?